<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, another day and it's somehow gotten worse as now it appears YouTube allegedly is covering up for Mr. Beast. We all know his most recent video, the Survive 100 Days in Nuclear Bunker Win 500,000, is becoming one of the most disliked video in, you know, a day, of course. It's not the most disliked video of all time, but 1.6 million dislikes compared to 3.2 million. Now, this is using an extension on Chrome that allows you to see the dislikes because they removed it a few years ago. And, of course, you know, YouTube, drama alert, would do some damage control. Look at this. We apologize. We just deleted a tweet showing 500,000 dislikes on Mr. Beast's new upload. This info came from a third-party app that allows you to see the dislikes. Fellow creators reached out saying that the third-party app is not to be trusted. We also got in contact with Mr. Beast for the real numbers. Now, we know Mr. Beast is, of course, a very trusted source. He would never fake videos, never fake pranks, never lie about his data or numbers to, you know, protect his um, assets or whatnot. And so apparently these are the real numbers, right? Apparently the video has 1,146,899 likes compared to only 4,000 dislikes, which is insane because my video covering the situation alone got 250,000 views. Now even if we were to do the math, it logically doesn't even make sense for the video to only have 4,000 dislikes when 250,000 people are watching videos going out of their way to look up videos about Mr. Beast hiding comments, ignoring allegations, deleting comments, right? It just doesn't make sense. And now Keemstar would give an update. This is an even more, you know, recent update. This is from 11.41 a.m., I think that's today, right? August 4th, yep. So this is from today, a few hours ago. Directly from Mr. Beast. Stop accusing me of being paid off. And we can see right here. Let me move my head just a little bit. Survive 100 days in nuclear bunker, win 50 or $5 million. 98.8% like ratio, right? And his average is 98.2. Somehow, somehow the video only has... It has 3,094,106 likes, only 37,722 dislikes. Now, that doesn't add up. That literally just does not add up. If more than 37,000 people are looking up videos that are against Mr. Beast, there's no way it only has 37 dislikes. I just don't want to hear it. You can try to give me the run around and say, well, not everybody cares. You know, not everybody is watching these videos and hating on Mr. Beast right now. Then why are they all getting a millions of views? There's literally no way that Mr. Beast's most recent video, after all of this controversy with Chris Tyson, with him giving people cease and desists, the Mr. Beast is a fraud video, is only getting 37,000 dislikes? Really? After he's going out of his way to delete all of the comments, filter everything out? Really? And a bit of an update on the video itself. Bro, I really wish these ASMR videos will go away. Y'all are making me, um, it's starting to make me look like a gooner, all right? But anyways, <laughs> the videos are like, you know, W Mr. Beast, who better? W Mr. Beast, very good video, big fan. I would have stayed forever. I love you, Mr. Beast. I enjoyed this video. Crazy how people hate Mr. Beast for one reason, when we have contributed to the society more than any man or YouTube has ever done. Oh my God, my feed is just gooned up to the max. I'm cooked. Anyways, we can see the clear bias in the comments. The only comments are, you know, glazing Mr. Beast, munching on that festival, right? There's not a single comment out there that lasts. And what people have been doing where they were taking like long comments and they were removing the spaces because he can't filter that out. So if I say like Mr. Beast space is a fraud, you know, it's going to get filtered out because fraud or something. But if people say Mr. Beast is a fraud with no spaces, the filter's not going to pick that up unless, of course, he adds that. So his comment deleter people are going, they're going, they're getting paid overtime this week, I'll tell you that, to say the least. Now, I guess for reference, I can go ahead and show you guys one of my own videos and how this extension works. Um, I made this video called Kamala Harris Allegations Are Bad. Obviously, in nature, it's political. People aren't going to want me to trash Kamala Harris. They aren't going to want me to get political if they're here for Mr. Beast videos. It is what it is, right? Now, this shows me how much um, views and things I got. It has 192 likes, 34 dislikes. Now, if I open that video up, 
Here's the extension. It tells me the video got 192 likes and only eight dislikes. So the extension is off, but the extension is showing less dislikes than I actually got. So in the case of Mr. Beast, we shouldn't be seeing a million dislikes if that were the case. If anything, we should be seeing a lot less dislikes than what the video actually got if we're going to try to use that scapegoat of what it is. Now for a little more context, I googled how accurate is the YouTube dislike extension. This is from two years ago, right? The dislike count is a guesstimate. The numbers come from cache data that was grabbed before YouTube disabled access to the dislike function in its API, as well as what users that own the extension do. So two years ago, of course, obviously this first part is completely irrelevant. However, it says if you have the extension and dislike a video, then that dislike gets reported to the extension server and goes towards the dislike count for others with the extension to view. However, if I am a user without the extension and I dislike the video, it's not going to be reflected in your account because I haven't reported my dislike to the extension's developer. So what does that mean? That means that the million dislikes that we're seeing are very well from a million people who have this Google Chrome extension. A million people with computers with Google Chrome is not a lot of people. It looks like a lot of people compared to the 3 million people that liked the video, which you can see from YouTube. But, you know, for tech savvy people and whatnot, that's not a lot. Again, it's insane that YouTube and all these other people are trying to come out and protect Mr. Beast as usual. And so, of course, Chucky comes out. You guys know Chucky. He's the one that made the video or the thread trying to debunk um, Dog Pack 404's video, Mr. Beast is a Fraud. He's the one that reached out to the girl who didn't get paid for um, her singing competition. That was actually a Chucky W for once. But he says, here's a video just in case anyone thinks it's fake. The Chrome extension saying it had 1 million dislikes is false. Now, this is from 12.04 a.m., today okay so three hours ago and it's showing the watch time 11 million views he scrolls a little bit and it only has 2 million 317 likes 20,000 dislikes again he even refreshes i don't care i literally do not care he can refresh a million times it is not physically possible this video the dislike situation the hiding comment situation has made it onto reddit it made it to asmund gold's channel i made a video on it a few other youtubers have made videos that have since went viral on this situation there is no way that video only has twenty thousand dislikes i don't care what anyone says you can show me any proof you can invite me to youtube's um headquarters right now pull the video up show me i don't care something is being hidden something's not right here and you guys are gonna have to let me know down below like and subscribe it share it let people know that not only is Mr. Beast, Mr. Jimbo, hiding and disliking comments and, you know, filtering out words that he doesn't agree with, he is somehow getting people to hide, take away dislikes. We're not going to allow it because we see all. We see all, Mr. Jimbo. <laughs> Peace out, guys.